Now here's a look at the defensive signees. Shavion Hatton is from Dangerfield. As a junior, offensively, Shavion doled out 32 pancake blocks, 18 knockdowns, and graded out at 84%. He switched to the defensive side of the ball as a senior and made 59 tackles. During his high school career, he was named All-District twice and All-State once. The Maroon and White Report rates Shavion as the number 15 player in Texas. Brandon Alexander of Brenham. This Cub from just down the road plays like a beast and was a late addition to the Aggies class, picking A&M over the likes of Texas, Florida, Oklahoma State, and Arkansas. He is in the rival's top 100 for the state of Texas and is among the Maroon and White Report's top 44. He was first team all district last year at Brenham while registering 59 tackles and five quarterback sacks. Lamarck Strahan from Blinn College. He comes from one of the best junior college programs in America, and last year was second team all-conference. The big man from Blinn also had offers from Big 12 South schools, Oklahoma State and Texas Tech, but chose to wear the maroon and white for the remainder of his collegiate career. Donnie Baggs is from Clear Springs High near Houston and is currently enrolled at Texas A&M and comes in with some impressive numbers. He rolled up 158 tackles in his final two years at Clear Springs, 101 of those as a junior, 14 of the stops that year went for lost yardage. Donnie is among Rivals.com's top 100 players in the state of Texas. Steven Jenkins from Coffeeville Community College in Kansas is another early enrollee. He is coming off a stellar campaign at Coffeeville a year ago. He registered 91 tackles. 17 of those were behind the line of scrimmage. To boot, he had six sacks, forced four fumbles, and even scored a touchdown defensively. Tyrell Taylor from Galena Park. Tyrell put up defensive numbers, tallying 70 tackles and nine sacks as a junior. Then, while being named the district's defensive co-MVP, had 65 tackles his senior season, 12 of which were quarterback sacks. In each his junior and senior campaign, he returned a blocked punt for a TD, contributing on special teams. Sean Ward from Lauderdale Lakes, Florida. Last year at Boyd Anderson High School down in Florida, Sean made 86 tackles and had nine sacks. He also returned an interception and a fumble for a touchdown. The highly coveted Ward chose the Aggies over offers that came from all over the country, including ones from the Florida Gators, USC Trojans, and West Virginia Mountaineers. Darzil Washington from Edgard, Louisiana. The Aggies went back to the Bayou to tap Washington. He was a late addition to the class. Darzil at West St. John High School was first team all district as a senior. He joins DeShazer Everett as signees from Louisiana. John Tell Franklin is from California where he went to Victor Valley Community College and he is already on campus at A&M enrolling early. In his final year of JUCO ball, John Tell notched 31 tackles, five interceptions and four pass breakups. Oklahoma State, Ole Miss, and Arizona State all offered Franklin, but he will wear the maroon and white of the Aggies. Devonta Burns from Arlington Martin High School is a defensive back that can tackle. In 2009, 102 stops, and he intercepted a couple of passes. In 2010, he was first team all district and had 69 tackles. He chose A&M over Iowa, Arizona, and several other BCS conference schools, and is among the Maroon and White Report's top 44 and rivals top 100 in the state. DeShazor Everett comes from DeRitter, Louisiana. Just like Burns, Everett is a DB who can flat out make stops. As a junior, he had 76 tackles, six for lost yardage. If you think that's impressive, check him out as a senior. 130 tackles, 10 behind the line of scrimmage. Everett was named All-State both seasons. 
Arkansas, Ole Miss, and Missouri offered DeShazor, among others, but he will now play at Kyle Field. Howard Matthews from Clear Springs. My goodness, what didn't Matthews do for the Chargers last year? 55 catches for 864 yards. On the ground, 107 carries for 1,003 yards. His touchdowns, six of them receiving, 11 rushing, four TD passes, two kickoff returns for scores, and a defensive TD. He was all greater Houston and all state as well. Rivals.com lists him as the 35th ranked player in the state of Texas. The Maroon and White Report has him at number 11. Taylor Bertolette comes down to A&M from Redding, Pennsylvania. He nailed the game-winning kick in the Under Armour All-American game. He was first team All-State in Pennsylvania, and Jamie Cole's kicking camp ranked him as the number seven kicking prospect in the nation. Rivals.com lists him as the number one kicker in America. Drew Kayser of Strongsville, Ohio, averaged 46 yards per punt as a high school senior. His coach in Ohio, who has sent specialists to schools such as Auburn and Notre Dame, calls Kayser the best he has seen. The Ohio native is one of seven out-of-staters that signed with the Ags in 2011. And that is the Fighting Texas Aggies signing class of 2011.